Lean is definitely becoming a more and more strategic topic in the desk of CEOs. With Lean, they don't just reduce their cost by a better efficiency. They also get more competitive advantage, reducing customer-facing time cycle and increasing value creation. By this way, they make company more adaptable by reducing go-to-market cycles. Last but not least, they keep motivated employees because Lean put them at the core of the operational change. This is why BCG developed a broad offer of Lean modules. We basically apply Lean service methodology and mindset to all support functions, especially in IT, where there is currently an important demand of efficiency, but also to any core process of service businesses, like banking, telco, or insurance. An important part of our Lean offering is Lean enablement. We don't commit just to operational improvements. On top of this, we commit to the transfer of the capability. We really want to make sure that clients can take it by themselves at the end of our case. For this purpose, we have developed Lean Enablement Centers in Düsseldorf and in Paris. Here, our clients can find all expertise they need for being enabled. We provide them with coaching, workshop material, tool techniques and simulations. Simulation is a new and innovative way to deliver training. We provide traditional classes and a scenario simulation to apply the learnings. This is a very efficient way of learning. We have developed several scenarios for many industries, all of them inspired by real BCG cases and all of them with real service pitfalls that add immense amount of waste to normal processes. This helps the participants to see what a large impact even small changes can have. So the first round of simulation ends up as very confusing and low performing. Nobody knows the whole process. Rule descriptions are clear, but not covering an unforeseen event such as reality. Standardization, as usual, is relative. There are different forms, it's hard to pick the right one, and it is easy to make mistakes when filling them. Workload is not always balanced. While some have loads of work to do and no time to press, others sit around waiting for more work to arrive. The participants very quickly realize that there is a lot of waste to process. Get sensitive to waste, recognize it, expose it. This is a very good first step in the Lean journey. At the end of the first round of the game, the trainer analyzes the achieved results. The group realizes that even though they tried really hard, there is only little success. The trainer asks the group to think about what exactly went wrong. This brainstorming is the initial basis for improvement in further rounds. After the first round, the trainer gives a lecture in which he explains the most important aspects and tools of Lean. All our trainers are very knowledgeable Lean experts, with more than 50 years of experience in Lean pioneering companies like GE, Toyota and IBM. The idea of the lecture is to provide the participants with the tools they can use to improve the processes. This improvement technique is named Kaizen, which is a Japanese expression and means change to the better. One important tool, for example, is the value stream mapping. To create an overview of the whole process and to assess for each and every step, if it is creating value or for the customer or if it's just waste. Remember, value is created only when the customer is willing to pay for that activity. This is a key concept and we want to show that, as in our scenario, rarely customer value creation is more than 10% of the total lead time. In the second and third rounds, participants implement the Kaizen they identified during the mini-workshops in between. One after round, they realize that better performances can be achieved by less people just working more efficiently than before. At the end of the third round, the process runs very fast and is aligned to the tag time, so that every step of the process takes the same time according to the customer demand. The participants have achieved a great success. We pay a lot of attention to the customer aspect because we know that technically Lean is a great concept. But in order to get the full benefit, the corporate cultures need to get the mindset of continuous improvement. This is why we make the simulation scalable to be delivered at all levels of the organization, from top management to operational people. We are offering this training for every industry and receive great feedback from clients that participated in it. If you're interested in introducing lean concepts in your company, please contact us. We are happy to help.